terror threats facing Kenya are increasingly localized. The latest findings of the probe into the recent Greece attack have aggravated such concerns. The country's interior ministry has confirmed there was a Kenya law graduate among the four attackers. The particular gunman, Abdurrahim Mohammed Abdullahi, was the son of a government chief in Mandur County. He was an ethnic Somali. Abdullahi's father reported to the authority last year that his son went missing. Reports say the local government was aware that Abdullahi joined the Somalia-based extremist group Al Shabaab after his graduation in 2013. Soon after the Greece attack, Al Shabaab claimed responsibility. The group said the attack in the Greece University's campus was to avenge the death of fighters who were killed by Kenya troops in Somalia. The identities of the three other gunmen have not been confirmed yet. But it is highly likely that they are all Kenya nationals, according to recounts of survivors. The gunman spoke the official language Swahili fluently during the rampage. Earlier investigation has led to the arrests of five suspects that may have links to the Grace attack. One of them is a security guard working for Grace University. Police investigation also found he possesses materials propagandizing extremist ideas. Kenya President Uhuru Kenyatta on Saturday said sponsors and fund providers for such extremist attacks are deeply rooted in the Kenya society.